Hi guys. Um, so I've never been very economically minded. I kind of struggled with that class back in high school. Um, I grew up with scientists as parents and really caring about the environment. And it always seemed like it was hard to put an economic value on a lot of environmental processes and things like that. And so um, my brain never really could hold on to it. So I'm kind of glad we're learning about different types of economics, such as the ecological economics and the environmental economics. Um, I found an interview with Robert Costanza from the University of Virginia, or Vermont, sorry, talking about ecological economics. Um, he says that it's an integrated picture of how humans have interacted with the world and how in the past, sorry, how they've interacted with their environment in the past and how they will integrate in the future. Um, it, and this helps design a sustainable future. Uh, this, he does argue it is not a sub-discipline of economics or ecology. It's kind of its own separate thing by itself. Um, this is different than environmental economics, which he says is a sub-discipline of, um, of economics. So it applies mainstream economics to the environment. Um, but back to the ecological economics. He argues it bridges ecology, economics, psychology, anthropology, archaeology, and history to kind of help create a bigger picture of how, how we relate to the world, how humans do, um, or to their environment. Um, and it's, so it studies everything outside the market and inside. There are three parts to ecological um, economics that are important. He talks about sustainable scale. Uh, that pretty much looks at that we're on a finite world with finite resources, a fair distribution of those resources. Uh, we see huge, we can see a gap between the wealthy and the poor. And so he argues that a lot of res we actually waste resources trying to keep that gap there versus just fairly distributing them. It'd actually be like cheaper or something. Um, and then efficient allocation of those resources. Um, so yeah, I, it looks like there's a lot more to go into, but uh, that's kind of a little intro that I learned and it hopefully it helps other people understand it. Um, so, so yeah, so I think I'm leaning more towards the ecological economics. I'll keep, keep reading about it though. Anyway, thanks guys.